to my channel my beautiful monarchs and today's video is going to be about mental health awareness um this month i believe october is mental health um awareness month and due to a recent circumstance in which i dealt with i wanted to spread the knowledge because it is real y'all mental health is important if anybody depression is a start and then it, it proceeds to other things please seek help if you don't want to seek help, talk to those people that make you feel comfortable. But I'm going to give y'all some tips on... I'm going to give y'all some tips on mental health awareness, so stay tuned. So, my first tip for mental health awareness and, like, you know, training your mind to not be overcrowded is by writing i suggest writing to anybody that i love or know or, or comes to me for any type of advice um writing can help you through a lot of things writing it, it literally declogs your mind so writing is very important when it comes to those moments where you feel like you don't know what you want to do or you feel like those thoughts come into play or you just wanting to just be done and give up um writing is the way um i write and i've had my depression moments i still do to this day um i deal with it different but i definitely do deal with depression still at times so yeah Tip number two would be to stay in contact with your loved ones. Always do not fret to talk to them, no matter how much you feel like you're a burden or you feel like, you know, they don't want to talk, talk to them because it can save you from yourself. You know, you're, you can be your worst enemy. And if you don't talk to anybody about it, you'll let your mind win. You can't let your mind win. You have to keep fighting. It is a purpose you serve. And God will guide you through that you know that leads into step number three any faith that you believe in any higher power or anything that you believe in have faith in it keep pushing keep going because it's necessary for you, you like i said you have a purpose to fulfill and it's just necessary that you continue to push through and fight keep fighting and I, I can't say that enough I can't stress enough to keep fighting um step number five so in my opinion there's a lot of people in your life that can be the cause of your depression or can be the reason why you feel the way you feel I believe that you should learn those people and cancel them out of your life some can be family, some can be close friends that you didn't even know. But those people that are causing you to stress to feel, you know, like you just can't go no more. And the thing, even things like things that are just not good for you that you do or you partake in, cut it out so that you can know what you want to do and what's good for you in your body. So I think that, you know, make sure that you are happy first. And at least to number six, do everything for you. This world, nobody really gonna care for you like you care for yourself. Don't do literally everything for you. Be super selfish, but make sure you take care of yourself first. And then, you know, also care for your loved ones and your other people, but make sure that you care for yourself first. You are the most important thing on this planet Earth because when it comes down to it, survival of the fittest, you know, the world can turn you out and destroy you and you can't let that and so can your mind so you got to keep fighting to anybody who is going through that keep fighting don't let it win keep going in the description box below i will be putting um the hotlines and um articles and anything that can help anyone who sees this video that is going through that and i will also be creating a number i'll probably do a whatsapp or a text now Either way, it's going to be in the description box below. Please, please, please text me whenever you need to. I will try my best to respond to you and get to you in time. Please don't fret to text me. 
I love all you guys and my beautiful monarchs and I thank you for anybody who has seen my Instagram and know what happened recently. I really thank you guys for loving on me, sending me messages. I might not have responded to everybody, but I really do appreciate you guys and y'all continuing to show me love and check up on me. I need it. I thank you guys so much. And from love of all my loved ones above, we love y'all. We all love y'all. Y'all are part of the monarchs. And um, just thank you for the continuous support of my channel and helping me grow. I will see you guys in the next video. Love y'all. This video was dedicated to my first love, Isaiah, a.k.a. Narkees. And I just want to say I love you forever and always, like I always will tell you. And I know you're here with me. Keep my mom safe up there. And... Run that money, kind of baby. <laughs>